What's good, YouTube? It's the masterpiece. And in this video, I'm going to show y'all in a limited gold bar glitch slash money glitch on Red Dead Redemption 2 story mode. But before we get into the video, make sure you leave a like on the video, a comment down below, and subscribe to my channel. So the location you want to be at is under the end of New Hangover. It's like under the end of New Hangover and east of Dakota River. And the place you want to be at is Lumpenny. It's like a burnt place. So let's go there. And when you get to that location, the exact spot you want to be at is the sheriff's office. It says sheriff on the front building. So let's go in there. And once you go in there, you go around the desk and you're going to see a little box that you can inspect. So go ahead and inspect that box. It's going to open. Then what you want to do is go ahead and take the gold bar. But right when you take the gold bar, pause the game. So right when you take the gold bar, make sure you pause the game. Then when you pause the game, just go ahead and save your game. So just go ahead and save your game. Then once you save your game, just go ahead and go to load game. Then load into the game that you just saved. So just load into the game that you just saved. Then it's going to put you in a loading screen for like 15 seconds. So you just got to sit there and be patient. So when you load back into the game that you just saved, it's going to spawn you near the location you're supposed to be at. Which is the burnt place. So just go ahead and head back to that burnt place. Back to that sheriff's office. So once you get back to the sheriff's office. Just go ahead and go inside there. Just go around that desk. And the box should be wide open. That's how you know it's working so far. So what you want to do now is just go ahead and take the gold bar. But now what you want to do is go ahead and close the box. Then when you close the box, go ahead and open it again. Then just go ahead and close the box again. You want to make sure that you do those steps. Then once you do that, just go ahead and save the game again. So once you save your game, just go ahead and load into that game that you just saved. And when you load into the game that you just saved, it's going to put you in the loading screen again. That's about 15 seconds. So just wait patiently. Then when you load back into the game that you just saved, it's going to spawn you near a location that you're supposed to be at. Which is in Limpany, the sheriff's office where you want to be at. So just go back there. So when you get back to the sheriff's office again, just go ahead and go behind the desk. And you'll know when the glitch is working when you see the box. And right behind the box is a gold bar. So when you see that gold bar right behind the box, it's going to say you can take it. So just go ahead and take that. And to show y'all that the glitch is working, I'm going to show y'all my satchel. I got two gold bars right now, but stay tuned for the end of the video because I'm going to show y'all how much gold bars I have. But after you take the gold bar, to keep doing the glitch, just go ahead and open the box again. Then make sure you close the box after that. You want to make sure you do them steps. Because if you don't do them steps, then the glitch will not work again. But after you do that, if you want to keep doing it, just go ahead and save your game again. So to save your game. Then after you save your game, just go ahead and load into the game that you just saved. Then it's going to bring you into the loading screen for like 15 seconds. Just wait again. Then let's go back to the spot. So once you load back into the game that you just saved, just go ahead and head back to the sheriff's office, which is in Lipany. You get back to the sheriff's office, what you're going to do is just go ahead and repeat the steps you just did. So go behind the desk and you're going to see a box and right behind the box will be the gold bar. And when you see that gold bar, just go ahead and take it. Just pick it up and take it. Now that's another gold bar added to the satchel. Then make sure you do these steps. Same steps as last time. Go ahead and open the uh, lockbox. Then close it. Then once you close it, just go ahead and repeat the steps again. Just go ahead and save your game. 
Load into the game you just saved. Then go back to the spot and repeat them the same steps. So yeah, this glitch right here is the best glitch that's out right now. This is way better than the horse glitch. This is way better than the $50 inspect glitch, whatever that is. And yeah, it's just the best glitch out right now. You're making like $500 from one gold bar or so. But when you load back into the game, just go ahead and go back to that spot. The sheriff's office. Then when you go back there, just go behind the desk. Then boom, the glitch is going to be working every time if you do the correct steps. It's going to be a gold bar right behind the lockbox. Then it's going to give you an option to take the gold bar and go ahead and take it. Then make sure when you take it, don't forget this step. Open the lockbox. Then when you open it, go ahead and close it. If you want to continue to do this gold bar glitch. But, yeah, that's how you do the unlimited gold bar glitch. You know. And as you see in my satchel, I got four gold bars now. You know. Four gold bars, and that equals to $2,000. But, hey, if you don't know where to sell your gold bars at, where you want to sell them at is the fence. So let's go to the fence and go ahead and sell your gold bars and make that some money. That's pretty much it for this unlimited gold bar glitch slash money glitch. I want to thank y'all for watching this video. Make sure I leave a like on the video, a comment down below, and subscribe to my channel. It's the masterpiece. And I'm out. And join that naughty gang too.